Welcome back to Minecraft, I'm Dave. And today, in honor of Cinco de Mayo, I felt like building the Taco Nian Cat. And this actually was a suggestion by Miner Pro, who's actually one of my friends here on YouTube. He wanted me to build the Taco Nian Cat, and I said, I'm gonna wait until Cinco de Mayo to put that one together. So here's the way the build's gonna turn out. I hope that you guys will build it. I hope that you enjoy your Cinco de Mayo. And let's go ahead and get into the build. All right, for this build, we're gonna need quite a few different blocks. So, to start with, we're gonna need black wool, light gray wool, pink wool, white wool, yellow stained clay, yellow wool, gray stained clay, red wool, and green wool. Once we get into building the actual kind of filling for the taco part of the body, we're gonna have to add a couple more blocks and I'll go ahead and indicate where we're gonna do that. So basically we're just gonna be focusing on kind of like the outside edge of the taco and that's pretty much it for right now. But uh, to get started, we're just gonna go ahead and start with the main portion of the body. So as you can see, I've already got one piece of black wool down. We're gonna go ahead and add one piece of black wool to the left of that. Now we're gonna skip one, two blocks, and on the third block, go ahead and put down one piece of black wool with two more after that, so one and two. Now we can go ahead and move up. Directly above this far left side here, we're gonna place one piece of our light gray wool. Go ahead and switch back to black. We're gonna add one piece of black to the left. And to the right, we're going to add one piece of light gray, followed by one black. Go ahead and move over here to these two blocks of black. We'll start on the left, add one piece of light gray on the left side. To the left of that, add one piece of black. To the right, add one piece of gray, followed by one piece of black. So from here what we can do is we can go ahead and we will start out here on the right side. We're going to go ahead and build up one. We're going to build to the right two, so one and two. And to the left, we're going to go ahead and build 23 blocks going to the back. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23. All right, now that we've built back the 23, we can go ahead and here we will add the rear paws. So on the very last block that we added, we're gonna go ahead and build down until we hit the ground. So that should be two blocks down, so one, two, Now go ahead and build to the right three blocks now. So one, two, three. Now directly above these three blocks that you just added, go ahead and switch to your light gray and we're gonna add one, two, three blocks of that, followed by one piece of black. I actually think we'll knock out this one piece of gray here and put a piece of black. That'll look a little bit better, I think. And then I think rather than, so here on this outside left edge, let's go ahead and move in one, knock out this block and put in one piece of light gray there. That way it'll look a little more like a paw. I think it'll be a bit better. All right, now from here, we're gonna go ahead and we'll move to the front of this paw. We're gonna go ahead and skip one block. On the second block, go ahead and build down two pieces of black wool, so one, two. Now build to the right two blocks, one, two. Directly above that, add two pieces of light gray, so one, two, with one piece of black to the right of that. And there we go. That should be all the paws now complete. So let's go ahead and move back to the front of the build. Now directly above this right side, we're gonna go ahead and put down one piece of our gray, light gray wool. To the right of that, we're gonna add one piece of black. Now we're gonna be adding light gray all the way back until we're directly above 
this second paw at the front of the build. So right here is where the light gray will end. So I will go ahead and give you the count now. So including this block, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 pieces and 11 pieces of the light gray wool. Now follow that with one piece of your black. Go ahead now and switch to your yellow stained clay. And we're gonna be building this back until we hit this point right there. So directly above the paw, because these last three blocks are just gonna be black wool. I'll go ahead and fill those in. So that's the way that's gonna look. So let's go ahead and fill in this mid portion with the yellow stained clay now. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11 blocks of yellow stained clay. So let's go ahead and move back to the front of the build now. Directly above this piece of black wool that we have here, we're gonna place one piece of our light gray wool. To the right, we're gonna add one piece of black wool. To the left, we're going to be adding three blocks of black wool. So one, two, three. Follow that now with one piece of your light gray wool. Go ahead and switch back now to the black. We're gonna add three pieces of black again. So one, two, three. Go ahead and switch to your light gray now. And you're gonna be adding five blocks of light gray. So one, two, three, four, five. Now follow that with one piece of black. Let's just take a look at that. That's looking good. Okay, now what we're gonna be doing is just to kind of give some detail to the taco portion of the body. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add one piece of this gray stained clay. And if you look back here, the third paw from the front of the build, if we come to the left side of it and we move directly up from there, we're just gonna add one piece of gray stained clay there. Now we're gonna fill in yellow stained clay back to that point. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six pieces of the yellow stained clay. Now to the left of that piece of gray stained clay, we're gonna be adding our yellow stained clay all the way back to the back of the build where that piece of black wool is. So that will be one, two, three, four, five pieces of the yellow stained clay. All right, so this is what we're looking like thus far. So we're gonna go ahead and move back to the front of the build. Directly above this far right piece of black wool, we're gonna add one piece of pink. And now to the right of that, we're gonna add one piece of black. Now to the left, we're going to be adding black going all the way across until we are one block to the left of this set of three blocks here. So I'll go ahead and give you the count for that. It would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine, including this piece of black wool. Now to the left of that, we're gonna add two pieces of light gray. So one, two, followed by two pieces of the pink. One, two, and then one piece of light gray, followed by one piece of black. Now to the left of that, we're gonna be adding yellow stained clay all the way to the back of the build. So we can go ahead and add our piece of black wool there. And this is gonna be quite a few yellow stained clay, so I'll go ahead and give you the count. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven pieces of the yellow stained clay. All right, let's go ahead and move back to the front. Now we can just build up directly above the black with one piece of black wool. To the left of that, we're gonna add one piece of pink followed by one piece of black. Now switch to your light gray. We're gonna add two pieces of light gray. So one, two. Follow this with three pieces of black. So one, two, and three. Now two pieces of light gray. One, two, and one piece of black. Now follow that with two pieces of light gray. One, two, two pieces of pink. One, two, one piece of light gray and then one black. Now go ahead and switch to your yellow stained clay. We're gonna add two pieces of this, so one, two. Switch now to your gray stained clay. Add one piece of gray stained clay. Now we're gonna be adding 
four pieces of our yellow stained clay. So one, two, three, four. Followed by one piece of gray stained clay. Now go ahead and switch to your yellow stained clay and we're gonna add three blocks of that. So one, two, three. Followed by one piece of black. Go ahead and move back to the front of the build now. We're going to build up here on the far right with one piece of black, followed by two pieces of light gray, so one, two. Now we're going to be adding two pieces of black, so one and two, followed by one light gray. Now one black. And now we're going to build light gray back four blocks to the left, so one, two, three, four, followed by two pieces of black, one, two. Now three pieces of light gray, one, two, three, and now one black. Now we're gonna be adding yellow stained clay again all the way to the back of the build. So right there where that piece of black wool is, we'll go ahead and give you the count again. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven blocks of yellow stained clay. So as you can see, it's really starting to come together now. Go ahead and move over here to the far right again. We're gonna build up one piece of black wool here on the right, followed by two pieces of gray, one, two. Now one piece of black and one piece of white. Go ahead and switch to the light gray. We're gonna be adding six pieces of light gray, so one, two, three, four, five, six, followed by one black, then one white. Now three gray, one, two, three and then one piece of black. So that's what the face is looking like there. Now to the left of this, we're gonna start out with one piece of gray stained clay. Go ahead and switch to your yellow stained clay now, and we're gonna be building all the way back to the far left here, where we're gonna go ahead and add this piece of black. And actually, well, we'll do it here in a second. So we're gonna add our yellow stained clay. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, I forgot to do one thing here. To the left of this black on the top, we're gonna add one, two pieces of black. And directly below that, we're just gonna add one piece of black right there. Because that's where the tail is gonna start. I forgot to do that on the row below. All right, let's go ahead and move back to the front of the build now. We're gonna go ahead and add one piece of black here on the far right. Now, we're gonna be adding light gray blocks all the way across the face here until we end up directly above this black here where we place our one piece of black. So it's just gonna go across the whole face here. So let's go ahead and switch to our light gray. I'll go ahead and give you the count. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 pieces. All right, so this is what we're looking like. So now to the left of the face, we're gonna be adding six pieces of yellow stained clay. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Follow that now with two pieces of gray stained clay. So one, two. Now add one piece of the yellow stained clay, followed by three pieces of the black wool. So one, two, three. Now add one piece of the light gray wool. And then follow that with two pieces of black wool. So one and two. Now we can go ahead and move back to the front of the build. And we're gonna actually be starting on the sombrero now for the head. So starting here on the right, we're just gonna add one piece of black wool going up. Now to the right of that, we're gonna add four pieces of black wool. So one, two, three, four. And now to the left, actually not four, we'll only do three, sorry. Now on the left side, we're gonna build up directly above the black as well. And we're gonna add three pieces of black wool going to the left over here as well. So one, two, and three. Now we're just gonna fill in directly above the head with black wool. So I'm not gonna give you an account here. 
it's just black all the way across between these two parts that we just built. So we're just going to fill that in really quick. And there that is. Now go ahead and switch to your yellow stained clay. And we're going to be building yellow stained clay all the way back until we're above this far left piece of the gray stained clay. So that's five blocks. So one, two, three, four, five. Now to the left of that, we're going to be adding two pieces of the black wool. One, two. And what you can do here is this is kind of where the contents of the taco are going to go, like I was talking about at the kind of at the beginning of the video. So we're going to skip that right now. So we'll just finish off this tail here. So to do that, what we're going to do is we're going to start out here on the far left side of the tail here on the black. We're going to build up one piece of black, add one piece of black to the left, and now switch to your light gray, add two pieces to the right, one, two, followed by one piece of black. So now that we're here, I'm just going to go ahead and finish off the tail. So we're going to move over one from the right. So directly above this gray here, we're going to add one piece of black, followed by two pieces of light gray, one, two, and then one piece of black. Go ahead and move up. And we're just going to build black all the way across these floor blocks. So one, two, three, four. And there's the tail complete. So now we can go ahead and move back to the front of the build. And we'll just continue working our way up. So we're going to switch to our yellow stained clay. Directly above this right side, we're going to go ahead and add one piece of our yellow stained clay going up with one piece of black to the right of that. Now go ahead and we'll move all the way across. Actually, we can just go ahead and add our yellow stained clay here. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to add yellow stained clay all the way across to the end of this black here. So as you can see, it's right below it. So let's go ahead and just fill that across here. Again, I'm not going to give you a count because it's pretty simple to follow. Now go ahead and switch to your black wool. We're going to be adding two pieces of black wool here to the left of this, so one, two. Now go ahead and switch to your yellow stained clay and add three pieces of that, so one, two, three, followed by one piece of black wool. Now we'll go ahead and go to the front of the build again. Directly above the black, we're going to add one piece of the yellow stained clay. To the right of it, we're going to add one piece of black. To the left, we're going to add one piece of yellow stained clay. And to the left of that, we're going to go ahead and be adding two pieces of the yellow wool. So there's one and two. Switch now to your yellow stained clay. And we're going to be adding 13 pieces of yellow stained clay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Now go ahead and switch back to your yellow wool. And from here, we're going to be adding five pieces of yellow wool. So one, two, three, four, five. Now we can go ahead and switch to our yellow stained clay and we're just gonna add four pieces of yellow stained clay. So one, two, three, four. Now to the left of that, we'll add one piece of our black wool. Then we'll add one piece of yellow stained clay followed by one piece of black wool. Go ahead and move back to the front of the build now. And we're going to be starting out directly above the black with yellow wool. So go ahead and build up one. To the right of that, we're going to add one piece of black. Now to the left, we're going to be building seven blocks going left of the yellow wool. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now go ahead and switch to your green wool here. Add one piece of green. Go ahead and switch back to your yellow wool. We're going to be adding five pieces of yellow, so one, two, three, four, five, followed by one piece of green. Now you can switch back to the yellow, and we're going to be building yellow all the way back until we're directly above this piece of black at the very back. So that will be one, two, three.
3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and 13 blocks is what that would end up being. Now to the left of that we can just go ahead and add one piece of black. So that's what we're looking like thus far. And I'm kind of thinking, I don't know yet, I might switch out this yellow stained clay in the hat with a different color. If I do that before the end of the build, I'll go ahead and let you know. Because I'm not really liking the way that it really matches with the taco body. I think that we need to use a different kind of color to make it stand out a little bit more, but we'll work on that in a bit. Okay, so now moving back to the front right of the build, directly above the black, we're going to add one piece of yellow. And now to the right of that, we're going to go ahead and add one piece of black. Now we're going to be adding yellow going to the left for, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, seven. We're going to use seven blocks of yellow wool. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, followed by two pieces of green, or three pieces of green, excuse me. One, two, three. Go ahead and switch to your yellow. We're going to add three blocks of yellow wool. One, two, three. Followed by three of the green again. One, two, three. Now you can go ahead and switch to your yellow. And we're going to be building yellow all the way back directly above the yellow over here. So we're just going to follow the row that's below. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12, including that block that we added. Now to the left of that, we're just going to add one piece of black. Now we're going to go back to the front of the build. And we're going to build up directly above the black with one piece of black. Go ahead and switch to your green now. We're going to add two pieces of green, so 1, 2 followed by two pieces of yellow, one, two. Go ahead and switch now to the green again. We're gonna add two pieces of green, one, two. Switch now to your black. And we're gonna be adding black all the way across until we're at the far left of that second patch of green there. So we'll go ahead and give you the count for that. It would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten blocks of black wool. Now to the left of that we're gonna add one piece of green followed by three pieces of the yellow wool. One, two, three. Now go ahead and add one piece of green. Switch back to your yellow and we're gonna go ahead and add four blocks. So one, two, three, four followed by two pieces of green, one, two, and then one black. Let's go ahead and move back to the front again. So we're gonna move in one from the right. So directly above this first block of green, we're gonna add one piece of black, followed by one green, then two yellow wool, one, two, then one green, then one black. Now we're gonna skip two blocks, so one, two, on the third block here, directly above the green as you can see below. We're gonna go ahead and add one piece of black, followed by two pieces of red, one, two. Go ahead and switch now to your yellow. Add four pieces of this, one, two, three, four. Followed by two red, one, two. And to the left of that, we're gonna go ahead and add three pieces of black. So one, two, and three. Followed by three green, one, two, three. Now add three yellow, one, two, three. Followed by one green, and then one black. Go ahead and move back to the front of the build. We're going to go ahead and move in one from the right again. So directly above the green we're going to start. We're going to add four pieces of black going to the left. So one, two, three, four. As you can see that's the front of the hat there done. Now we're going to skip over until we hit this black wool block right here next to the red. We're going to build up one. Now to the left of that we're going to add three pieces of red wool. So one, two, three. 
followed by two pieces of yellow, one, two. Go ahead now and switch it back to your red. Add four pieces of red, one, two, three, four. Followed by two pieces of yellow, one, two. Now we're gonna go ahead and switch back to our black. And black is gonna be built all the way back until we're above this green here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and then seven including that piece of black there. Okay, now we can just focus on this middle portion of the hat, and then we'll go ahead and fill in the taco. All right, so here on the right side, we're gonna build up one piece of black, followed by one red, then one yellow. Now four red, one, two, three, four, followed by two yellow, one, two. Now three red, one, two, three, and then a black. Move back over here. Go ahead and build up one piece of black here on the right, followed by one yellow, well actually more than one yellow, excuse me, three yellow, one, two, three. Now two red, one, two. Go ahead and switch back to yellow. We're gonna add four yellow, one, two, three, four. And then we will add two pieces of the red, one, two, and then one black. Over here on the right side, we're gonna move in one from the right. So above this yellow, we're gonna add one piece of black. And we're just gonna be adding yellow all the way across until we're above the red over here on the left. So that will be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 blocks of yellow, followed by one black. We'll just stay here on the left. We'll build directly up above the black with black. We'll add another 10 yellow, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10, followed by one piece of black. Go ahead and move up again, we'll add one piece of black, followed by 10 yellow, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10, followed by one piece of black. Now we can go ahead and move up. We're gonna move in one on the left, add a piece of black, followed this time by eight pieces of yellow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now one piece of black. Go ahead and move up again. Move in one from the right. Add one piece of black. This time we're gonna be adding six pieces of yellow. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Followed by one piece of black. Now we'll go ahead and move up. Here on the left, we're just gonna move in one. And we're gonna add six pieces of black. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And there we go. That's the hat complete now. So now we're gonna work on filling in the taco body. And then I think we will change out that yellow stained clay at the base of the hat just to make it look a little bit better. All right, so first things first, I made a change at the base of the hat as you can see. So I switched it from the yellow stained clay. I just went with the hardened clay. So it's pretty easy to do, just knock out the base that we did with the yellow stained clay. You can change it if you like, you don't have to, you can do whatever you want. I just think it looks a little bit better with the hardened clay. So that's what it'll look like changed. So now I'm gonna focus on filling in the contents of the taco body, and then we'll go ahead and work on kind of the streamers back behind the Nian cat. So for this, what we're gonna need is we're gonna need first brown wool, lime wool, red wool, orange wool, and black wool. So we'll start at the very base here. So as you can see, we have this one block that's missing right here. We're just gonna add one piece of lime there. And go ahead and move up. Just to the right of the tail, we're gonna add one piece of brown, followed by one red, then one brown. Go ahead and move up. Directly above the red, we're gonna place one piece of the lime followed by one brown, and then one orange. And you can kind of mix this up however you like. You don't have to necessarily follow the way that I'm doing it, but if you want it to look like mine, you can do it this way. Now we're gonna move over one from the lime. So directly above this brown here, we're gonna add one piece of black, followed by one lime, and to the right of that, one piece of brown. Go ahead and move up. 
directly above the black, we're going to place one piece of orange, followed by one brown, then one red. Go ahead and move up, move over one from the orange. So above the brown here, we're going to end up placing some lime, followed by two orange, one, two. Now we're going to move up, move over one from the lime there. So directly above the first orange, we're going to go one piece of red, then one black, then one brown. And then directly above the red, we're going to add one piece of red with one piece of red to the right, and then two pieces of brown, one, two. And there we go. That's the taco kind of filled in there in the back. So now we just need to work on the streamers back behind the build. All right, so there's what he's looking like thus far. We just need to add the streamers on the back side. So for that, we have red, white, and green wool. We're gonna go ahead and start with the red. We're gonna start here at the base. So you can see this one kind of single light gray block here on the rear paw. Directly to the left of that, we're gonna start adding our red wool. And we're gonna build back 10 blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Okay. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna be doing kind of five rows of each color. So from this point, we can build up four blocks of red. So one, two, three, four, and that will be all of our red. So we can just go ahead and build that back and I'm not gonna give you the count because it's pretty easy to follow. You just build it all the way back till you match up with that red at the back. There's two, here's three and four. Now we're gonna to switch to our white and we're just gonna follow along and end up at the very back of the red there. So there's one row. Here's three rows, four and five. Okay, now we're gonna to switch to our green wool here. And as you can see, we have a block here on this side that we're gonna go ahead and we will actually be adding green there. And then to the left here, we're gonna go ahead and add green going back to where the white ends. Okay. Now we can go ahead and we'll build up four more rows here. So here's one. Two. Oh, whoops, I forgot to go back because we wanted to do it. There we go. Here's three. And now right here, we would actually have a shift. So the colors shift kind of about every 10 blocks. You can kind of do it how you like, but basically right here is where the shift would occur. So if you follow the line of the body down here at the base going up and you move over one block to the left, this is where your shift would happen. And so what happens is every 10 blocks, the color moves up and down. And so at that point, we'd have a shift down. And you'll see what I'm talking about here in just a second. So what we're gonna do here for the next kind of set of colors, we're gonna move down one block from the top so starting right here, we're going to build to the left 10 blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And that was of green wool. Now we're going to build our four rows directly below that. So here's 1, 2, 3, 4. Now switch your white. Here's 1, 2, three, four, five. Now switch to your red. There's one, two, three, four. And we just need to make sure here on this bottom row that we only add 10. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, so as you can see, we have a color shift. And we just had, we would have to follow it there at the top as well. 
So that way it makes sense. And there you go. All right, so this is the way the build's gonna turn out. I'm very pleased with the way it looks. I think it's quite comical. I always have a lot of fun putting together the Nian cats because I think they're pretty cool looking. And they're fun to build in Minecraft because they're 8 bit so it's easy to build them in Minecraft. I hope that Miner Pro likes the build. I hope that you all do as well. Have a happy Cinco de Mayo. As always, it's been a pleasure. Remember to like and subscribe, and definitely take care.